Okay, so our first thing is our word problem. So, uh, the teachers are planning on taking the middle school students on a field trip. There are 2,748 students. If 24 students go in each minibus, how many buses would we need? Um, so, yeah. So now we're going to figure out the situation. We have 2,748 divided by 24 equals something. Um, so this is your dividend. Oops. Dividend. Dividend. Uh, so, yeah, this is your dividend. And, um... The dividend is the uh, amount of students we have. Um, this is our divisor. These are the amount of students that will go into each minibus. So the amount of students in each minibus. And um, this is the quotient. Oops, sorry. Uh, this is the quotient. Q O. This is the amount of buses. Um, so, yeah, so the dividend is the amount of students, and the divisor is the amount of students in each minibus and the quotient which is the answer is the amount of buses um now we're going to figure out what kind of problem this is um since we're taking uh since we're taking 2,748 and splitting them into 24 students per group and trying to figure out how many buses we would need, we're finding out how many groups, pretty much, that we'd need. So, it's a grouping problem. Okay, so now we're going to solve the problem. Uh, so since we have the total 
number of students, which is 2,748, and the groups that were, uh, the number of students that we're dividing them into in each group, 24, um, we're going to have to find out how many buses we would need. So, let's say, okay, we have 100, if we take a hundred away we're take we're doing twenty four times one hundred which is two thousand uh four hundred um so basically that's saying taking a hundred buses we're taking two thousand four hundred students away. So then we are left with 348 students. Now I'm going to take 10 buses away. Um, so 24 times 10 is 240. Um, if we take that away we have 108 left. Um, So, now I'm going to take 4 away, which I'm taking 96, so because 24 times 4 is 96, so that leaves me with 12. Um, so, since... Uh, so we have 12 students left, um, so we have 12 students left, but we can't leave these 12 students behind, so we're going to need an extra bus. Normally, we would have 114, because we'd be doing 100 plus 10 plus 4 which is 114, and these are the amount of buses, the number of buses we are going to be having. Um, but now we're going to need 115 because we can't leave these 12 students behind, but that, that last bus is just going to have half the amount of students that a nor normally the other buses would have. Okay, since we've ha we have the answer now, we are going to have to put it back into the problem. So, um, we would need this amount, um, but since we have da 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 left over, we will need da da da. So we would need one. 114, but, oops, uh, but since we have 12 left over, we will need 115 buses. That is our answer. Um, so, yeah, thank you for watching. Um,